jbeans.net. We sailed on the Carnival Glory for seven nights in August 2022. Our Category 4F inside stateroom was located on Deck 7 aft toward the back of the ship. Just a quick note that if you enjoy this video, please give us a thumbs up or leave a comment. It really helps our channel. And consider subscribing so you get alerted when we add new videos. Our room had two twin beds that were converted into a king bed. Two end tables were located on each side of the bed, and both end tables had a lamp as well as a small cabinet for storage. One of the end table lamps had two USB charging outlets available in the base. Underneath the bed, there was a good amount of space for storing luggage. Our room had a Pullman bed that was located against the wall near the bed area. Our jelly bean used the Pullman bed during our cruise, and the bed included a railing for safety, a removable ladder, and a ceiling mounted light. The bathroom for our stateroom was located near the entrance to the room and was quite small, like most cruise ship bathrooms. The sink area was located on one side of the bathroom with a trash bin located below. Three wall-mounted shelves on each side of the sink area offered space for storing toiletries. And a small, movable, wall-mounted makeup mirror was also available. Overhead at the sink area, a shaver electrical outlet was available. Opposite the sink area, the bathroom included a standard cruise ship shower with a shower curtain. Inside the shower, dispensers with shampoo and shower gel were available. A couple of towel racks were mounted on the bathroom walls near the toilet for hanging towels and other items to dry. Additionally, there were a couple of hooks mounted on the inside of the bathroom door. Our room's closets were also located near the entrance to the room. The three closets were relatively standard size for a cruise ship and provided a good amount of storage for our family. The first closet had a lower shelf, upper shelf, and hangers available. The second closet also had a lower shelf, upper shelf, and hangers available. However, the upper shelf was used for storing life jackets. And the third closet had three shelves and a full-length mirror on the inside of the door. Between the closets and the bed, a small cabinet contained the room's refrigerator. The area also had a mirror and two hooks for hanging items. A desk with a lighted mirror was located at the foot of the bed. The desk area also had a stool-type chair and a wastebasket. Four drawers for storage, including one drawer that contained a small hairdryer. A phone a Type B outlet, and a multi-type international outlet. Drinking glasses and a metal tray. A small cabinet with the room safe, which could be locked with a personal code. And the room's TV, which was located above the safe cabinet. The TV featured 24 channels, with about half the channels dedicated to carnival information, cruise and ship information, and ship cameras. Two complimentary movie channels rotated movies each day during the cruise. A schedule of movies was available through the TV. The rest of the channels featured CBS News, Cartoon Network, HGTV, Food Network, Travel Channel, and more. The TV's channel guide always displayed the current date and time. 
A sticker on the wall beside the desk provided a QR code that could be scanned to see the ship's room service menu. And a QR code directory at the desk could be scanned for quick access to safety information, stateroom cleaning, and more.